how would his bloated body be released from the vehicle after death, but he couldn't get out while alive? That never made any sense to me. The autopsy report indicated that he had water in his lungs and it indicated no foul play, no marks to his body that may have been like someone struck him over the head or anything that would have knocked him out. But it also showed us that there were no injuries from a car wreck. When I've spoken to various investigators or talked to them about this, I've always been told that it appears to be a car accident. Very unfortunate event, and he drowned. But he could swim, so we were made to believe that for some reason he had this wreck, came out of the vehicle, drowned. So that made no sense to me.